When rebar is delivered to a construction site, it usually is accompanied by a bill of materials and certified mill test report. The mill test report, usually required by the architect or engineer, will certify that the material shipped conforms to the project specifications. This example of a mill test report has two items. The first is from heat number 70542, number 5 or number 16 metric, 60 feet long, specification ASTM A615, A615M, grade 60 or 420 megapascals. The second is from heat number 70546, number 5 or number 16 metric, 60 feet long, specification ASTM A706, A706M. Toward the right, the physical characteristics, yield and ultimate strength in pounds per square inch and megapascals, then the elongation percentage, a measure of ductility, followed by the bend test, marked OK, and last, the weight variation from the theoretical weight per lineal foot. Also tabulated is the chemistry of the steel in terms of percentage of carbon, manganese, phosphorus, sulfur, silicone, chromium, nickel, copper, molybdenum, and vanadium. The most significant is the CE, or carbon equivalent, required information if those bars are to be weld spliced.